Okay, meteorologist Lauren Casey joining us. So uh, we've been in this uh, pattern here. We're being yeah. rained on. How is it down the shore? It's not great, it's but not people great. are making the best of it. At least a couple of people are because they're out there. They're on the beach. We're like, oh, we don't care about the clouds. They're playing cornhole, right? They're getting a little cornhole game in there. Having a good time. Let's see if we can check out their skills here. Oh, there's like a lull in the game. Are we going to see, see any action? Come on, it was going Come on, strong. Come on, it was going strong. Uh, it's all in the wrist. Oh, he was teeing up too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're, they're slacking at that game, but at least they're trying to have some fun down the shore today after this gloomy day. Gloomy all across the Delaware Valley. Check out our high temperature in Philadelphia today. We were at 88 yesterday. Today, 74 degrees, more than 10 degrees below our average high temperature of 85. That's because we have this northeasterly component to our wind flow ushering in this cooler air and temperatures right now are in the 60s in Philly, Reading, and the Poconos. We're at 73 in Atlantic City, one of our warm spots, 75 degrees right now in Wildwood. But down the shore, you have a bit of a breeze kicking out of the northeast, right off the ocean, up around 10, 16 miles per hour. But at least we did get a break in the humidity department today. Dew points below that 70 degree threshold. So it feels muggy, but not oppressively humid. That will be the trend again tomorrow. Storm scan three showing us, you know, fairly quiet conditions. We had that drier air building in so we didn't see that downpour style activity through the day today but the rain that we did have was persistent and slow moving despite the fact that the intensity is light to moderate so we still did have some issues with some flooding even a water rescue in parts of Chester County and we do have some rain coming down right now the heaviest of rain right now in parts of Chester County and Delaware County right now stretching out from West Goshen back into Marple that area has been persistent over the last several hours and in storm on storm scan three seeing a couple of sprinkles light showers kind of just slowly meandering through Burlington County over the next couple of hours. We'll see this trend for areas of light rain and mist and then kind of tapering off late tonight. Mostly cloudy with a low of 65 degrees so it can probably open up those windows and then for our day tomorrow another day with high temperatures below average but not significantly so we'll be at 81 degrees with a mix of sun and clouds and maybe just an isolated shower south otherwise a mainly dry day to kick off the work week. Future weather showing us pretty quiet as we head throughout the overnight period. That rain will start to taper off. Looks like we have a dry Monday morning commute. Clouds still around. We'll see the sunniest, sunniest of conditions tomorrow. I-95 points north and westward, so not looking too bad in the Lehigh Valley and Poconos tomorrow. There's that chance of a very isolated light shower south of the city of late day tomorrow. For your Tuesday, we're seeing a pretty good commute. Increasing cloud deck, though. Showers and storms start to pop during the afternoon hours and then become more numerous as we head late day Tuesday and into Tuesday. Tuesday night due to a strong cold front that's going to be moving on through. So a pretty good bet of wet weather Tuesday night. Wednesday is going to be our day of transition, clearing skies, turning breezy and less humid. And looks like this is going to kick off a stretch of sunshine that could persist into as we head into next weekend. And as well, taking a look at your seven day forecast Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, all featuring sunshine, low humidity, overnight lows that are going to feel pretty good dropping back into the 60s. So this is really the most significant pattern change we have seen. Months. Maybe when? in months. Months. <laughs> yes. Since 